Yo, so big match set up, man. Uh, Paul Lynn against BJ Fakakis. Mm. Going down July 9th on the Monster card at the Monster Factory. So what do you think, bro? BJ's been on a roll, man. He just had a big win in uh, Tulsa, Oklahoma against Matt Sartori, who mm. we all know, six foot six. Matt is uh, no slouch. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Paul Lynn coming off of also another uh, big win. And so what do you expect, bro? BJ Fukakis, he looks like a painful dude to arm wrestle. He'll he'll kind of wait for his pronation to get set and then he'll just reef you all the way over. Uh, he's a big dude. Does Paul have the hand? I mean, it seems like if you shut BJ's hand down, you know, there's a lane in there, but um, can Paul Lynn pull that off? I mean, he came off a huge win lately. It's possible, huge weight difference uh, between the two, but um, Paul's, yeah, Paul's on a bit of a roll right now, yeah. I, I didn't have him winning the last match and he, he dominated, so. What do you think, uh, uh, is it, what does Paul Lynn walk around at? Uh, he's he's getting up there these days. I think he's probably around like 2.30 or something around no, there. No, 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 he's, uh, he's someone that's lighter than everyone thinks. Um, I think he walks around at like, he's fat at 2.20 in his words, I think. And he likes to get around that 200 to 210 around there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't think he's 230 heavy. <laughs> so that this is going to be a test for him because we all know that BJ's, I mean, BJ's got to be like 380 or something like that. So it's definitely over 100 pounds. So it's going to be a test for Paul. Excited to see this match. Mm. Um, another one that uh, was announced on this card, which uh, I'm really excited about this, is... Uh, Craig Toulier, we all know Craig's a legend of our sport. He uh, just had a really big showing over in Louisiana State. Um, he met up with Dan Mosier, which is a training partner of his on, in the tournament. And uh, Craig got the win, which it was a war, but uh, definitely showing the level that Craig's at the, uh, currently. And uh, Roger Cunningham, uh, a lot of guys don't know him, but uh, he got on my radar recently when he, he uh, gripped up with uh, Brandon Elsessor and they had an absolute war. I think it went down in Ohio. I think there was a little conflict with the, the referee that day. And mm. But uh, what are you thinking, bro? Well, who do you think takes the win that day? I mean, it's another really interesting match too. Yeah, he's all hit. And he's got some grind to him too, but the way that Roger just gets coiled up and tight, it's, uh, I mean, if he gets to stop, I'm gonna give it to Roger, but Craig Tuyo's hit ain't no, <laughs> it ain't nothing. Definitely so, not. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a easier said than done, stopping that hit, so um, these are really good matches. Yeah, way to go, Monster. Uh, you picked some good ones. Looking forward to it. So everybody get over there uh, July 9th. Make sure you're subscribed to the Monster's channel. Um, he's doing big things lately at the Monster Factory. And uh, we really appreciate all these great high-level matches he's putting together. And if you haven't already, make sure you click the subscribe button on my channel. Smash that like button if you're liking this content. Have a great day, everybody.